Hey everyone! It is that time of month again. I got my Beauty Box 5 box in the mail the other day. Here it is. Beauty Box 5. Beauty Box 5. So excited. I got it Friday and I took it to work with me and it was like shaking the whole time. I'm like, what is in here? I mean, just listen. What is in here? I can't wait to see what's inside. I'm so excited. I love my Beauty Box 5 boxes, so... I know it's been a while since I did one. It moved and everything. I'm in a new apartment now and I'm loving it. It's great. So I feel so much happier now. A lot of things have changed and yeah. So I don't think you really want to hear about my life. So we're going to get into the box. What do you say? I say yes. So, hold on. Uh, scissors. Scissors, so that I can open the box, because it hasn't been open. Okay. Da -da -da -da! Opening the box. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry if I'm creeping you out. I'm just, like, been in a really good mood. It's, like, 8 o'clock in the morning. So, here we go. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, fall on fleek. Okay. So, this is the September box. September two 2015. I'm not going to look at the back, even though I just peeked at it. I don't really know what I saw. It was just like a bunch of different things, and I think I saw the color red. That was it. So, I'm not even looking in the box. I'm just going to pick up what's on top. Oh, it's just a stupid win five thing. <laughs> uh, I do this every time. I don't win anything. Beauty Box 5, please let me win once. Come on. Okay. Um... Alrighty. Oh, okay. This is a eye crayon, I guess. And the brand is Be A Bombshell. And I'm assuming that the color is The Boss. And let's face it, I'm an older sibling. I'm The Boss. So, let's check this out. Get out of the package. On. Seriously? Nothing's cooperating. Ah, well, the lid came off of it. What in the world? Okay. So, I thought, like, from the sticker, it was going to be, like, black. Because, like, the sticker is black and it says the boss on it. So, I thought it was going to be black, but it's like this really pretty, like, pinky color. You seeing this? It's really pretty. Maybe I should swatch it. We're going to swatch it. Okay. It's like a... I don't know. On my hand, it kind of looks like it's like a gold, maybe? Like a goldish pink? It's really pretty. I like it. Don't know how often I'd wear it, but it's really pretty. It's, it's, it doesn't really have a smell, but I had to smell it anyways. So, this is cool. I love eyeshadow, like, eye crayons, because you ain't gotta worry about no brushes. You just spray it on, or you know, with your finger, you blend it out. Okay, what's this? The next thing is from, I'm guessing it is Beautiful Nutrition is the brand. Not exactly sure what this is. It says lemon rinse. It's a gentle clarifying treatment. What is this going your face? Oh no, it goes in your hair. Okay. 
It's a pH balancing restorative rinse. So basically, I guess it like makes your hell, yeah, your hell, your hair really healthy, I guess. Which I guess mine could always use, cause let's face it, whose hair couldn't use some health to it or moisturizing. But I guess it removes dulling product buildup, balances scalp for healthy hair growth, smooths cuticles, enhances shine, boosts volumes, which I don't really need volume. I have enough of that already. Doesn't look like it right now because I just washed my hair, so it's kind of, you know. And it says it's for all hair types and for color treated hair, which is good because I just colored my hair, so that's good because I'm like half a fright right now that it's gonna like turn into an orange copper looking color and then I'm gonna look like a freak. But we're not gonna get into that. But um anyways let's see what this smells like. It smells like lemon which is awesome because I love lemony scented things. So this is it there. I'm gonna definitely try this out should be good. It smells so good. I want to smell it again. Mm. It smells so good. Okay. And next. Let's see what else we got here. Harvey Prince. Oh. Is it perfume? I don't know, but this is the packaging. Can you see it? See it. Okay. It's called Harvey Prince. I've never heard of this brand before. Is it like a hot, really high-end brand or is it a new brand coming out? But I like how the inside is like orange, like cool looking. So yeah, it is perfume. And I'm guessing it's called Sincerely. Let's see how it smells. Oh. It twists. It don't pop off, Becky. It twists. Ew, it's like a roll-on thing. Oh, yeah. Mmm. I guess it smells kind of good, but it, like, reminds me of, like, the perfume that my grandma wears. Not that that's a bad thing or anything. It just, it reminds me of my grandma, which is a very good thing. I wish y'all could smell it, but can you smell it? Can you smell it? Smell it. You can't smell it? I'm sorry. It, it smells pretty good and like, I think it smells good, but like, I would just smell it. I don't think I would wear it. I don't know. I'm like into like the fruity, fruity, florally kind of stuff. You know, I want to smell like cotton candy, so. I actually did have a perfume like that when I was growing up and going to school. It was cotton candy smelling perfume, and I smell like cotton candy going like to school. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can smell, but you can't eat. That sounds terrible. I shouldn't have said that. Okay, and the next product is from Bella Pia cosmetics and it's looking like it's a loose eyeshadow um i don't normally use loose eyeshadow my fear is is it like getting everywhere because that's just something that i would do i'd end up getting out all over myself or like all over my floor good thing i got a vacuum but anyways the shade is snowflake which aptly named because hello it is white so oh my goodness they got a safety seal in here ah! uh, y'all I love safety seals let me get it out I want to see what it looks like ooh Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Right. Ugh, I don't want to get the eyeshadow everywhere. It is very glittery looking. I will tell you that right now. It is very, it is very shimmery. Like, 
I just took the thing off and it's already like shimmering on my fingertips. But I will put a little bit of my hand and just swatch it so I don't spill it everywhere. Oh wow, yeah. Oh my goodness. That is super, super shimmery. I mean, like, look, look at my finger. It is... I'm going to spill it. I better put it down. I put it right here. It's like super, super shimmery. Can you see it? Can you see it? I can't tell if you can see it or not because I ain't got no viewfinder. I ain't got one of them awesome cameras that everybody else got. So until I get one of those, I'm just going to have to guess that you can see it. So we'll just have to deal with that. But yeah, that's very pretty. I could probably, probably like one of those products, like a little bit would go a long way type of a thing. Because <laughs> put too much on this on. Woo! I'll probably see you from the moon. And the last product is a lip and cheek stain. Oh my goodness! I wanted a lip and cheek stain for so long. Who is it that has one? It's like a really popular brand that has one. Oh my god, I can't think of the name of it. Oh, it just slipped my mind. Oh my god. I cannot remember the name of it, but like everybody was using it. I'm like, oh my god, I want it. And then I was like, I looked at the price of it and I'm like, <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to look to see if I can DIY this. And I was looking up DIY and people were like putting, like using like Kool-Aid and I'm like, I really don't want to be putting Kool-Aid on my lips. Do you know how like tart and sour that would be? Mm. No, thank you. But no, this is called Tints and Sass. And it is Lip and Cheek Stain. It's from Elizabeth Mott. That name sounds so familiar. I think I've heard that name before. Elizabeth Mott. I don't know. But I'm going to open it up. Because I am so excited. Definitely be putting it on my lips. I'll tell you that much. I don't know about my cheeks. Because I don't want my... I don't really like reddish blushes. I want them more like a peachy kind of tone to them. Maybe a little corally, but not too much corally. Or I don't really care for, like, red. <laughs> I'm trying to get it out of the package. Why is everything going to be so difficult to get out of the package? And, you know what, I have really long nails right now, and it's not helping. This is so upsetting. Oh! Oh my god. Why don't I use my scissors? That would be smart, yeah? I think I possibly got it. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yep, definitely got it out. Look at that. Tint. Sass. Tint and sass. Ugh. Oh, so excited. Ew, it's like one of them lip gloss things. See it? Can you see it? Like one of them lip gloss tube end thingies. Oh my god, that is so red. Alright, let's try this puppy out. Don't want to spill it. That is super pretty. It's not like a deep, deep red, which is good for me because, to be honest, I'm kind of afraid of putting dark colors on my lips. But, like, this one I think we'd be okay with because it's kind of like a reddish pink color. It's, like, really pretty. I like it. So I'll probably end up using it. And if I had a mirror right now, which... Don't have out currently. Probably could use my phone screen, but I'm not gonna do it because it's dark and probably ain't gonna be able to see too well, and I'll probably look like an idiot. And we ain't got nothing out but worms, and I'm not gonna put them all over my floor because I don't feel like cleaning them up. 
But yeah, so out of all five of these, excuse me, I have an itchy nose, I'm not picking, I swear. So out of all of these products, out, out of all five of these products, I'm pretty happy with every single one of them. You know, Beauty Box 5 usually like has good stuff and they definitely do this time and like one of the things that I'm definitely excited about out of all of them is definitely this tints and sass. Like, super excited about this. <laughs> Been wanting something like this for so long and then I finally get one. I'm just like, yes! So, I'm really happy with this. I can't wait to try it out. I can't wait to try out the, um, the hair thing, the, um, restorative rinse stuff. I love it because it smells like lemon and I love lemony scented things. Like a sugary type of candy lemon scented things. If that makes any sense. So pretty excited about that. Um, I really like the smell of this perfume. Like I said, it reminds me of my grandma. I might wear it, but I think I'm mostly just going to smell it. So, yeah, pretty good, happy with that, too. And it, who can't always use a white eyeshadow for a highlight? Like, come on. Or if I would end up running out of my highlighter, I could always use it as maybe, like, a substitute until I can get some. I mean, it is, like, sheen enough and shimmery enough. And it's kind of like one of those things, like, a little bit goes a long way. And last but not least, the eye crayon. I'm always happy with eye crayons. I love them. And I really like this color. And I've never heard of this brand before, but I like it. So hopefully it doesn't irritate my eyes or anything because, let's face it, I have problems with the mascara. I have problems with eyeliner. I can only use certain mascaras and certain eyeliners. But, um, so... Okay, let's go over how much this stuff is. Alright, the first thing I'm seeing is the Tints and Sass by Elizabeth Mott. Holy crap! It retails for $22.99? Like, oh my god. Like, are you kidding me? Like, are you seriously kidding me? $22.99. I'm definitely freaking, like, using this until eternity. Because there ain't no way I'm going to buy something to put on just my face for $22.99. That's something I could use to, like, for food or, like, bills or something. Like, oh my gosh. Okay, and the Beautiful Nutrition Lemon Rinse Gentle Clarifying Treatment uh, retails for $10. Now, is that this size or is it a bigger size is what I'm wondering because if it's this size for like $10, <laughs> forget it. I'm trying to look to see what the ounces on this and I can't find it. God, my arm itches. Excuse me. But yeah, so retails for $10. The Harvey Price um, Sincerely Perfume retails for $21. Well, he must be a top brand. I've never heard of him, but $21 for this perfume? No, thank you. So glad I got it from Beauty Box 5 because I wouldn't spend $21 on a perfume. No, thank you. We'd be lucky if I spend like $10. And the Bella Pierre powder in Snowflake retails for $19.99. Oh my god, you must be paying for the name because. <sighs> Jesus. My goodness, and the eye crayon retails for $14. $14 for this little thing? Oh my goodness, like, 
the first thing already covered my box. Like, these boxes are only $12 a month. And, like, I only got this box for $12 and I got all this stuff for, like, this has to be over $100. Or close to it. I'm not going to sit here and do the math because I really don't feel like it. But, like, dang. Like, just this product here paid for my box. Seriously. Because this box is only $12 a month. And you can do it monthly, quarterly, or every year. And I'll put a link down in the description below of the... Um, website, it's just beautybox5.com, but I'll put it down there anyways, and I'm waiting in the mail for my Ipsy, I'm going to get my first Ipsy bag, so I'm so excited, um, to get Ipsy, see how they are, they're $10 a month, and they do the monthly, quarterly, and the, um, yearly as well. So sorry, it keeps scratching my nose and it itches for some reason. Somebody must be talking about me. <laughs> Stop it. Anyways, um, also one thing before I go, um, I'm also looking for some sort of a video editor type of download or something off of the internet. I don't know. I'm having trouble like finding a good one and I don't know what to use or what would be a good one to use. So if you guys could leave like a comment down below as to be like what a good video editor would be to use because like the one here on YouTube is just so confusing. Like I'm so confused with it. Like <laughs> I'm lost. Like entirely lost. So if you could leave a comment down below to let me know like what ones would be good to use, what ones to steer clear of, whatever if you want to. Also leave a comment down below about what you think of these videos. Um, if you want to go ahead and click the subscribe button. I don't film videos all the time. I think this is only on my, my third one so enough of me ranting. I'll leave you go, and you guys have a great day. Bye!